गुड इवनिंग हेलो हेलो वेलकम Hey, how are you? We're going to start. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Welcome. How was your weekend? Tell me. Uh, very good. Thank you. Good, excellent. Did you rest? Descansaron? Did you rest or did you work? I rest. Right. I rest. Excellent. Hey, Adriana Erasmo. Ana Beatriz. Andrea Cecilia. Present. Excellent. Brenda Guadalupe. Present. Great. Brenda Isabel. Present. Excellent. Carlos Ricardo. No. Carlos Roberto. Present. Excellent. Cecia Beatriz. Darlene Stephanie. Denis Giovanni, Edith Vanessa, Present. Excellent. Fatima Margarita, Present. Excellent. Flavio Emanuel, Present. Great. Gabriela Maribel, Present. Excellent. Carla Azucena. Carla Vanessa. Present. Excellent. Luis Edenilson. Present. Excellent. Marvin Alexander. Present teacher. Great, Marvin. Miguel Antonio. Present teacher. Excellent. Nancy Yacel. Nancy Soledad. Nora Eloisa. Pamela Noemí. Raquel Abigail. Richard Joel. Robert Adalberto. Present. Excellent. Ronnie Alexander. Present. Great. Roxana Francisca. Present. Excellent. And Jamie Marisol. Okay, so today we are going to continue with section three. Okay, then. We already start the vocabulary from section three, or no? Jobs, vocabulary, and activities. 
No. Yes, right. Ya vimos el vocabulario, ¿verdad? Con ustedes. De la section 3. O no habíamos iniciado nada con ustedes de la section 3. No. No, ok. De las profesiones, no. Uh -huh. Sí, yes. hablamos de Ajá, las profesiones. Ok, yes. yes, the vocabulary. And we did the, the first exercise, or no? Mm, let me see. What do you do? Okay. Yes, we did the exercise, right? We match the pictures with the name of each, each profession or each job. Yes? Okay, yes, then yes. we have different places in which these uh, professionals could work. So in a hospital, for example, we have a doctor, a nurse, and what else or what another profession we can include that work in a hospital? Receptionist. A receptionist, okay. What about in an office? A receptionist. Also. What else? In an office? We have many people who work in an office. Okay, can you mention some? Secretary. A secretary, okay. Lawyer. A lawyer. Okay. A lawyer. What else? Office of the police. Which one? Police officer. Police officers. Well, the police officer can be in an office but most of the times a police officer works on the street. But yes, we have a few police officers that make the paperwork. Okay. Okay, one more. No more. Assistant. Ah, sería secretary, quizás lo mismo, ¿verdad? Yes, secretary. Okay. Okay, so let's try Counter. in a... Which one? Counter. 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 Contador. Ah, accountant. Well... We didn't mention an accountant, but we can include. Okay, what about in a store? Who can work in a store? Salis person. Okay, salesperson. Who else? Cashier. Cashier. Okay, what else? 
security. A security, security word. Mm -hmm. What about in a hotel? In a hotel? Waitress? The section is. Okay. Waitress or waiter. Receptionist. Oh, yeah. Cook. A cook or a chef. Yes. Okay, great. Manager. Manager, okay. It's like an administrator, right? Okay, yes. So now, do, do you have any, any other that you want to include in those categories? What about if we talk about what they do? For example, the receptionist. What a receptionist uh, does. Yes. Housekeeper. Okay. In a hotel, right? Yeah, but you can explain to me what a reception is. Uh, does okay for example i can say um, the doctor um, check the people who are sick or injured the nurse help the doc helps the doctor with the paperwork or assist the doctor in an operation room. Okay, what about the receptionist? What can you tell me about it? About uh, the duties of a receptionist. No ideas. For example, here. She is taking a phone call. So a receptionist takes phone calls. What else? A receptionist talk to the customer. Okay, he is the customer. Okay, the receptionist talk or speak to the customer. Okay, what about a police officer? You don't want to talk today. It's Monday. You don't, don't have enough energy today. Okay, let's move to the next activity. Uh, 
Okay, it would be a homework. You're going to pick one, one profession of each category. One for a hospital, one for an office, a store, and a hotel. Okay, pick one, one profession and you have to explain what does this person do, okay? This will be for tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm going to ask you again and I hope to have some answers, okay? So let's practice the conversation. He works in a hotel. This is the vocabulary. Mm. Hey. Let's do this exercise. It's exercise three point two. Okay, look at the picture and answer correctly about the profession. Remember, capital letters are necessary. Okay. okay what's his job? Okay, here you are going to practice also the pronouns. Okay, what's his job? The possessive pronouns. Okay, he is a receptionist, a receptionist. What's her job? She is a doctor. And what's her job? She is a nurse. Okay, we have one, two, and three. Okay, next, what's his job? He's a pilot. Okay, he is a pilot. What's her job? She is a flight attendant. <laughs> yes, she is a flight attendant. Okay, what's his job? He's, he's a, a musician. musician. Yeah. He's a musician. Musician. He's a musician. He, what's her job? She's he, a singer. He's a singer. Yes. She's singer. What's her job? She's a judge. She's a judge. Okay. She's a judge. And what's his job? She's a police officer. Mm. Oh. Okay. He's a lawyer. Yes, a lawyer. Mm. He's a lawyer. No. Police officer. No. Ah, yes. Police officer. Yes, 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 yes. He's a police officer. Es para que despierten. He and yes. The next is a lawyer. Yes, he is a lawyer. Okay, 11. What's his job? He's he a is cook. a cook. Okay, he, he is a cook or a chef. Number 12. He's a, a waiter. waiter. 
a waiter, a waiter. A waiter, boy. He's a waiter. Es como cuando dicen wait, de esperar. Wait. So it's a waiter. Thirteen. She's a waitress. She's a waitress. She's a waitress. Yes. She's a waitress. A fifth. No. Fourteen. She is a question. He or she? She is a question. He is a salesperson. He is a salesperson. Salesperson. Fifteen. She's a cashier. She's a cashier. She's a cashier. She's a cashier. 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 And sixteen. She's a security work. Okay. He or she? She. She. Okay. she. she is a she. security ward. Okay. What happened? No quiere trabajar. But they are correct. They are correct. Okay. Now we have the... We don't have the conversation here. We will use... Works at night. Work. This is a cashier. Handles money. Okay. This is part of what you are going to do as a homework. So explain what a, a particular person of each category uh, does. Okay. But we don't have the video. Hi everyone. In this class we will and practice. If we analyze the first example, where do you work? So when that happens, the and repeating. No. Now I would like for you to practice. Okay. So let's move to the manual. Okay, he works in a hotel. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he is the manager. Okay, so... Well, in a hotel... Um, it's not too common to say that they have receptionists. They call, they call from desk agents. Okay, for example, 
um, because they treat directly with the customers, with the people who wants to stay in the hotel, okay? So they are front desk agents. And yes, here we have um, like the boss in this case will be the manager, the manager. Okay, I need two volunteers to practice this conversation, please. Me, teacher. Denise and Roxana. Okay. Me, teacher. Okay, Roxana and Dennis, are you ready? Okay. 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 Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother work, works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's, he's the manager. Okay, thank you. Only interesting. Vamos a Esa hacer le iba a preguntar, the, the stress syllable at the beginning. Interesting. Interesting. Yes, correct. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, Carla and uh, Carlos. Quintanilla. Ok. Carla Susana o Carla Vanessa? <risa> Carla Susana. Ok, bueno. ¿Quién eh, comienza? Yo sí, Uta. Ok. Where, where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel. To his from that. that Gained agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He dance, doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, uh, he is the manager. Okay, thank you. Questions about vocabulary or pronunciation? Dex uh, gained. Which one? Dex, Dex again. Ah, front desk. Agent. Ok, es lo que le decía que... Agent. Agent. From desk agent. Que we usually, or we used to call them receptionist. But in a hotel, they do more things that a than a receptionist do. Um... Because a reception is only take phone calls, messages, or but in a hotel they they also do another things like for example, uh, give the key, look make make a reservation, take the phone calls, um, if the customer has, um. Mm, something that he or she uh, dislikes about uh, the hotel, 
so they can take that um that idea so they they do more than the receptions not 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 only uh also i think you 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 have to pay to them or in that part of of, of the ho the hotel in the front desk okay the front desk es como donde usted llega y también cuando se va when you leave the hotel okay, you you have to go to the front desk to give the key and uh, to pay if you uh, own something so that that that's the difference but and that's the front desk agent como okay. un vestíbulo yes yes correct okay more questions So let's continue. If we have reduction of do and does. Grammar, simple present with double H questions. If we didn't have the, the audio here, okay, to practice. But um, in these cases, when you have a consonant at the end and then you have a vowel, it's um, common to say as if we have only one word. Okay. Where does he? Where does he? Como de corrido. Okay. What does he? What what does he do? What does he do? Que no como hacer la pausa o la separación, sino que se hace se une el último sonido de la consonante con el sonido de la vocal que le que le que continúa. Okay, y en el en este caso que sería a la inversa. Eh, we begin with the vowel sound and then we move to a consonant. In this case, the Y sounds like a consonant. Can you remember? Uh, I explained I've a couple of classes ago that letter Y has two sounds, one as a vowel and one as a consonant. So in this case, it's working as a consonant. So you're going to, to join or say together the do you, do you. Okay, como de corrid. Eso sería to practice, okay, to practice how you are going to say, say the, the do and the does, okay, the inner reduction. And then we have the simple present double H questions. Y ya habíamos visto las double H words, que en este caso serían las que vamos a utilizar para este tipo de pregunta, which, eh, which is an open question. Okay, when you ask for information. And we have where, what, how, and well, where that where, what, and how. Estas son las que tenemos acá, pero vimos más, ¿verdad? Y decíamos que vamos a empezar siempre con la double H word. Luego vamos a utilizar el auxiliary do, que where do you work. Luego iría el sujeto, and then the verb. En infinitivo o en su forma simple. Porque estamos utilizando auxiliares. Let's see. Where does he work? Entonces se recuerda que 
habíamos dicho que íbamos a modificar algunos verbos en el tiempo presente simple cuando estos eran tercera persona del singular. But when we use in our sentence an auxiliary, it is not necessary. Ahí no es necesario. Okay. So let's do some examples. Uh, we have, where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I am a doctor. How do you like it? I really like it. Okay, where's, where does he work? In a hotel. What does he do? He's a manager. How does he like it? It's okay. Where they work? In plural. In a restaurant. What do they do? They are waiters. How do they like it? They hate it. Okay. Mm, I need two volunteers. We are going to make those questions. And we are going to say real answers. Okay, for example, mm, Fatima. Would you ask me these three questions, please? Ask to me the questions. Okay. Where do you work? In a school. Uh, what do you do? I am a teacher. How do you like it? How, how do you it. like it? I love it. Well, it, it is... It's I uh, love it is not here as an example, but because I love it, I have to say it. So you can say like it. Okay, I, I really like it or I enjoy it or um, it's okay. It's so-so, not good, not bad. Okay. Or I hate it. I hate it. Okay, es es que no le gusta para nada. Está ahí porque ni modo. So that's the case. If you hate your work because of different reasons. Okay, so now two volunteers to do the same. The questions and the answers. Volunteers. Oh my God. Ronnie and Nancy. Yo. Okay. Okay, Pamela. Pamela and Ronnie. Where do you work? I'm businessman. Businesswoman. What do you do? Uh, sorry, eso sería en la segunda. Pero la primera tiene que ser un place, porque la pregunta es con where. Okay, make the question again, Ronnie. ¿Cuál sería? Perdón. Otra vez la primera. Tienen que contestar con un place, con un lugar. En la respuesta, eh, Pamela. Where do you work? No sé cómo, cómo se dice en inglés eso. Eh, un bar, pero no sé qué sería entonces. A bar. Ajá. Yeah, así es the same. In a bar. Yes. What do you do? I'm a boss. How do you like it? I really like it. Okay. So you are the manager. Pamela? Ande? You are the manager? Yes. Yes? Okay. Okay, thank you. 
two more volunteers. Me, teacher. Yeah, Roxana. Me, teacher. And... Okay. Con quien sería? ¿Quién dijo? Me. Cuando buscando, pero no lo veo. Ah, okay. Empiezo. No, Marvin. Okay. Thank you, Marvin. Where do you work? I'm a work at police station. Uh, what do you do? And and a police officer. How do you like it? Mm, I'm really like it. Okay. Mucho lo pensó, mucho lo pensó. <laughs> okay, thank you. Excellent. Okay, the last, last two. Only two, two more. Brenda, do you want to participate and edit? Okay. Call Brenda. Yes, Brenda, Isabel. Okay. Comienzo. Okay. Where do you work? In an office. What do you do? I am a receptionist. How do you like it? I really like it. Yeah. Okay, excellent. You don't sound so sure, but we are going to believe. Okay, now we have these conversations. And then you have to practice. And let's see. Okay, I think. Mm. I think it's the same, right? Mm. Yes. Yes, yes. It's the same. Okay. Complete. Select the answer that contains the two words needed to complete each question. Number one. How does she like? How does she like it? How does, How does she like it? Okay. How does she like it? It's difficult, but she loves it. Number two. Where work? Where work? Where and the question? Where work? No, the complete question. Where does your brother work? Okay. Where does your brother work? At the airport. He's a pilot. Next. Yes. Oh. How light. Oh, like. How does remember to say the complete answer? Oh, how does he like it? No se coman el it again. How does he like it? Yes, correct. How does he like it? He doesn't really like it. Okay, how does he like it? Um, conversation three. How do your parents like their jobs? Okay. How do your parents like their jobs? 
how do your parents like their jobs? Oh, I guess they like them. Okay, next. I don't remember. Where go? Where, where work? Where work? Where do they compare? Do they remember? Where do they work? Where do they, do they, work? Do they work? work? Where do they work? I don't remember where do they work. In an office in the city. Conversation four. What do you what do? What do you do? do, you do? Okay. What do you do? I'm a student. And the last one. I see. Yes. How do you like? Your class. How do you realize? How do you like your class? Yes. 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 Okay. I see. How do you like your classes? Hey, they're good. I like them a lot. Excellent. Okay, let's check. No quiere contestar. Okay, this is the exercise 3.7, 3.7. Okay, now we are going to practice double H questions. Vamos a, a practicar las double H questions. So think in at least three. No, oh, two. <laughs> two double H questions. Okay, utilizando eh, where, how, why, and you're going to type it here on the chat. Okay, go. You can start. It's clear what you're going to do? Yes. Okay. So please type your answers. Well, your questions. Using double H words in simple present tense. Así como los ejemplos que hemos visto. Okay, the examples, give me your examples. Okay, where do you study? Okay, remember to start with capitals. Where do you live? Okay. What else? Where do you work? Yes. Hey, hurry up with your examples. Or do you prefer to do it orally? What do you do? Where is everyone? Okay. Hmm. I have the same question. <laughs> okay. What do you eat? Hmm. I'm not sure about 
da Carlos. It sounds like present continuous. Y recuerden los usos que vamos a que, que, que va, para los que nos serviría el simple present. Que okay, siempre estamos con el simple present. Solamente que ahorita estamos formulando preguntas. Pero digamos que las, las reglas de uso del tiempo en sí siempre serían las mismas. Entonces, por eso digo de que it is not a... Eh, dijimos que le vamos a usar para routines. Well, mm, where do you eat? Pero tendríamos que agregar entonces un marcador de tiempo. Agregue un marcador. Carlos. What do you work? Sería where do you work? Carla. Where do you work? What is your favorite color? Okay. What does she do? Okay. When is your birthday? Okay. Remember to use capitals. What is your favorite food? What do you eat? Mm. What do you... Vaya, podríamos dejarla así. What... Do you regular regularly eat or normally eat in the morning? In the morning. Eh, algo que nos indique que estamos en el tiempo en simple present. What do you regularly eat in the morning? Where do you exercise? Okay, only the capital, only the capital. Where do you work? What's his job? Where do they work? What do you, what do you cook? que okay. este es in present continuous sería este Roxana what okay or or qué es lo que quiere preguntar o qué es lo que quiere decir eh ¿Qué cocinarás ahora? ¿O qué estás cocinando? Ajá. Ah, ok. Sí, entonces no sería presente simple si queremos decir que estás cocinando. Bueno, no se vayan a confundir porque no los quiero confundir because it's, it's a different tense. What are what are you cooking? Y este es ¿Qué estás cocinando? ¿En qué vas a cocinar? What are you going to cook? Mm. Even if I say today, it is implied that will be later today. Today, but later. Okay, in future. Or what are you going to cook tomorrow? What are you going to cook on the weekend ok entonces oh, pero okay. estos no son los, los tiempos que no aplicarían ahorita esos tiempos porque ahorita solo estamos con el simple present vale, vamos oh, a okay. hacer los últimos ejemplos de forma oral ok to volunteers to make the questions se recuerda que iba a ser al menos Two. Okay, you are going to make the questions and you are going to pick a classmate. Va a seleccionar a quien le va a hacer la pregunta. So I'm going, I'm going to start with 
Um, que with Luis and Nilsson. Yes. Anyways, and the question is. Um, what do you do? What Sorry. do you do at work? So I work in the university. No, but listen, cuando yo digo what, yeah. es diferente a cuando yo digo where. Oh. Uh -huh. What do you do in your work? I so uh, processor data and information. So you you process data. Oh, there. Okay. So I process data. Okay. I process data. Now, now is your turn. You're going to ask something and you're going to pick a classmate. Hey, no se vaya, Carlos. Okay, Luis. Seleccione a alguien y hace su pregunta. Okay. Parla Vanessa. Uh, what do you... What do you hobby? What is your hobby? Okay, ask again. Um, Repita la pregunta, Luis, correctamente. And then you answer. What is your hobby? Hobby. Yes. What what do you do in your free time? That's a hobby. Okay, a volunteer to answer the question. Podría ser my hobby is to watch TV. Okay. Yes, Andrea. Okay. No. My hobby is uh, playing soccer. Play soccer. Okay. Podría decir uh, to, to answer the question. My hobby is or también puedes decir I like porque it's something that you you enjoy to do in your free time. Okay, but both both answers uh, were correct. Yes, están bien las dos. Okay, now Nancy, make the question, please. Robert. Buenas noches. Ok, Nancy. Eh, what is your favorite pet? Ok. Again, quiero escuchar la doble H word. What is you, your favorite pet? Ok. To Robert. It. Que, que... It's, uh -huh. or you don't like animals. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite? Dog, cat, parrot, rabbit. Snakes. 
Dog. Dog. Okay. Thank you. Okay, so you have to continue to practice, please. And tomorrow, a ustedes son los que les tengo que dar la receta de perico, perdón. En la sopa de perico. Because you don't want to speak in class. And you have to speak to practice. Siento que solo yo hablo. You have to talk too. Así que para mañana, prepare the soup, please. Ok, ya, ya nadie me faltaba en la asistencia. Carla Azucena. Present. Ah. Ay, wait. Adrián. Ana Beatriz. Carlos Ricardo, Cecia, Darling, Nancy Hassel. Present. Ok. Nancy Soledad. Present. Ok. Nora Loiza. Raquel Abigail. Richard and Jamie. Jamie isn't here. Okay, so that's all for today. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. 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 Teacher. Teacher. Yes. A mí no me mencionó. Ya le había tomado asistencia. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ok, bye. Bye.